Since the dawn of civilization, mankind is engaged in sport. Sport, or sports for short, are competitions intended to settle disagreements between teams or individuals. These disagreements can be over anything, but are usually centered around whose brain can handle stress most reliably or who is more efficient at the transport and delivery of balls of rubber. Though sports are dangerous by nature, there have been many advents over the years in order to make things safer and more enjoyable for its participants. Swimmers now wax all of the hair off their bodies in order to avoid appearing homosexual. American baseball players have switched to using wooden bats instead of ones made out of fire. Football, once a barbaric sport, is nowadays, with proper protection, one of the safest around. Undeniably though, the greatest advent of all came in the 1950s from mathematician Jeremiah Score of Shermer, Illinois. Score theorized that in order to accurately determine the winner of a sports match, numeric points should be awarded after the successful completion of a given goal. Then, the team or individual with the most points at the end of a set period of time would be the winner. The sports community's atheist leaders vehemently opposed Score's theory, accusing it of being anti-chaos and anti-meaninglessness. They believed victors should be determined by natural selection, meaning that the leaders, naturally, should select victors as they see fit. Score was tried and found guilty of committing a crime against nature. He was initially sentenced to house arrest, but when it was discovered he lived in a barn, he was instead sentenced to cow's arrest. When God was discovered years later, the sentence was overturned, and Score's theory was immediately put into practice. Score was never told of this, as by then he was long dead of methane poisoning. Nowadays, very few people remember Score even existed. If you tell most people the following joke, which was quite popular in the 50s, they will stare at you, unblinking, unlaughing. Try it out at your next outing. Question. What do you call a farmer in a barn? Answer. Keeping score. <laughs>